Ryan, welcome to Birmingham City Football Club. Just sum up your thoughts for us, first of all. Um, obviously delighted to be here. Um, feels like it's dragged on for a while, but um, I think to be here f uh, through the door this early is obviously always a positive. I can now enjoy my pre-season with the lads, get to know everybody. Obviously, I know one or two already, but mm -hmm. just to get to know everyone, get to know the gaffer even more. Um, and just, I'm just delighted to be here. So why Blues and why at this stage in your career? Um, I just think it was probably the right thing for me. Obviously, I was on loan at Millwall for the past 18 months. Um, I managed to get a lot of games, which I was obviously really pleased about. Um, but as I said in an interview previously, um, I'm just looking to really find a home again where I can get settled and get in, really enjoying my football and mm. get back to the best that I can possibly be. Mm. Have you had a chance to meet the manager yet and what's he had to say to convince you to join? Yeah, I've met him. Um, he seems like a really good guy, um, first, of, first of all, but I just wanted to really ask him a few questions as well, just to, you know, because I'm 27 now, I'm at a good age, coming into my prime probably, and, um, but I still want to improve and, and that was the most important thing for me. I think it was a matter of choosing a club on where I think I can best improve and, you know, choosing a club that's going to suit me and, it's obviously ideal that it's on my doorstep as well so you know that would, that was a big pull as well and like I said I'm just delighted to be here and, and I'm really looking forward to getting going. Mm. You've built up quite a reputation for being that confident ball player midfielder who's you know his strength is in possession is that something you'd agree with that you're at your best when the ball's at your feet? Yeah definitely um, I think I think that's when I come alive more than anything um, I love being on the ball and I love having touches of the ball and you know if I can bring more more attacking players in better positions, you know. Then obviously we can. I'll sort of assist the assister whenever I can, and mm. hopefully we can, you know, we can play some really exciting stuff. Mm. And the manager spoke about trying to get better in possession as a team, yeah. and as someone who likes the ball at their feet, that must be music to your ears joining the football club at this stage. Yeah, definitely. And obviously, like, as I said, that's why I wanted to meet the gaffer again because it's a waste of time me going to a team that's gonna that's gonna kick it and lump it because mm. it's just not. It's not the way I, I see the game being played. So for him to be saying that, you know, he's obviously a, a massive pull for me. And hopefully I can come here and, and add to that. And as I said, hopefully we can start playing some really good stuff. Mm. Does it feel like you're joining the club at a good time as well, the way we finished the season last year under the new manager, going into a new campaign? You're here in time for pre-season as well. Is timing right for this move? Yeah, I think it is, yeah. Um, as I said, it's on my doorstep. that The gaffer wants to play the right way, in my opinion. I liked the gaffer as a person, um, so all those obviously were a massive pull for me. But um, I think the past three or four years probably haven't been that good for the club. Um, so to see the gaffer come in and the real positive results, you know, that managed to keep the club up at the end of the day. Um, and we're just hoping to, well, I'm hoping to come in and, and help build on that and, and you know see where we can see how high we can finish. And you've signed on a, a three-year deal, which gives you the comfort, but also shows that the manager has confidence in your ability, doesn't it? Yeah, definitely. And I think, as I said, at, at 27, you know, I'm, I feel like I should be coming into my prime now. Uh, it takes me up to 30, which, again, is still, still probably a good age, especially for someone who plays football the way I do. Mm -hmm. um, but, yeah, as I said, I'm, just, I'm excited to be here. I can't wait to get going and can't wait to, to go to St Andrews and, <laughs> and play in front of the, the crowd rather than them giving me a bit of stick. <laughs> it sounds like you've been on the, yeah, the, the wrong end of uh, some hostile crowd at St Andrews. How much are you looking forward to, to being on their side when you go back? Yeah, it'll be great. Yeah, I'm just, as I said, I'm really excited to, to just feel it, yeah. you know, and, and just to have crowds in, in general. You know, it's been a nightmare and it's probably not been a very enjoyable experience at all for the past however long it's been now, but I'm, I'm buzzing for them to be back and I'm buzzing to play in front of them. You've already mentioned it, you're still just 27 years old, yeah. you mentioned potentially coming into your prime now. It feels like you've been around so long because you've got so many appearances yeah. under your belt. But do you believe that the best days and your best years are still in front of you? Absolutely, yeah. Um, you know, I think the beginning of my career through Shrewsbury, Brentford, uh, all the way probably up until I was about 23, 24, I had a really, really good time in football and I didn't really know what a low felt like. Mm. Obviously, I went to Stoke and it didn't work out, I think that's obvious to everyone. Mm -hmm. um, went to Millwall, started to enjoy my football again, getting games again. And as I said, I just want to come here, find a home where I can really settle down, enjoy my football and, you know, hopefully 
the fans will enjoy the football that we're going to play. Mm -hmm. You mentioned Millwall a couple of times, 46 games mm -hmm. last season. Is it about taking that momentum, the fact that you've played a full season right the way through into the new campaign now? Yeah, absolutely. And that's all I'd ever known, really. You know, as you've said, I've played a lot of games uh, for my age and um, that's all I'd ever known. So it was real, you know, it was it was hard for me to not play every week as I was. Um, so, you know, for me to, to hopefully come here and continue that and, and as I said, help the team and, and hopefully help myself in performances and, and you know, but let's just see where we can go. Mm -hmm. Ryan, welcome to the football club and look forward to seeing you out there. Cheers, thank you very much.